Hey guys, so this is Anthony with a quick video to show you how to add uh, a website to your kid's uh, VTech InnoTab Max tablet. Now, you know, make sure that you obviously set up your parental controls because um, your kids will only be able to, you know, visit those specific websites. Uh, so first things what you need to do is uh, just uh, log in through the parental controls and this is the icon, you basically just drag and drop it right here into the circle. Okay, and then once you do that, it'll ask you for the password. And then once you do that, it'll bring you to the parental controls uh, dashboard. Uh, and these are a whole bunch of apps. And as you can see, this one right here says web browser controls. So just click on that. So in this section right here, as you can see, there are a whole bunch of tabs, pre-approved sites, history, then you've got time limits, and browse. And under the pre-approved sites, as you can see, there are two tabs. Oops, so sensitive. Uh, there are two tabs, VTech Selected and Parent Approved. So under the V Selected, you'll see uh, you've got sites, videos, and games. So when you go to sites, these are the sites that are available. Okay, these are the VTech uh, approved uh, sites. Now, as you can see on this uh, section right here, if you've got two, three kids set up here, uh, they will all show up here. Currently, there's just one that I've set up here. And as you can see, there are these check marks right here. So for each kid, you can basically, you know, um, check one, check these uh, little circles, as you can see. All right. And same thing for, for videos. You know, these are the, the VTech uh, kid-friendly videos. And same thing for games. Okay, so these are the games and the same principle applies here you basically you know uncheck these little circles depending on you know which kid you want to give access to so going back to what we were talking about you know adding a website so you basically go to the parent approved ones and currently there's just this one so you know to add a new website you just click this browse and add button and um, it's going to take you to this um, it's going to load the the home page which in my case is you know vitakids.ca and what you want to do is just uh, click on this uh, browser address bar and let's just say you want to add pbskids.org all you got to do is just type in www.pbskids.org okay and then hit this go button and as you can see it's going to load the PBS Kids website and then once that happens and it loads all you got to do is just uh, click on this uh, add button okay and then it's, it'll give you this dialog box saying that uh, you know web website added to the parent approved list and then if you go to the pre-approved sites and go to the parent approved sites as you can see it is right here. So that's pretty much how you do it. Of course, it's it's always important to like set up the parental controls. Uh, as you can as you can see, you know, if it's not set up, you know, uh, you can easily use this tablet to just browse any website. So I suggest that you really take the time to just set it up and uh, set up the parental controls. If you've got any questions, uh, you know, feel free to leave them in the comment section. Cheers.